one, two, three. Testing one, two, three. Testing one, two, three. Hello. Testing Hello. one, two, three. Yeah. Hey, B Dubs, just came over to see you because we haven't really seen each other. Oh much my you're gosh! When I'm online, Joel, it's it's such it's so sad. It's so sad. I keep getting on and thinking, oh, I'm gonna hang out with Joel today. Today's the big day. I'm gonna hang out with Joel, and it never happens. <laughs> well, today's the day. I just wanted to come over and say I love the tree. The tree is so cool. You I like the tree? Thank you. It's so good. It's so good. Should I put leaves on it? Uh, I don't know. I think it looks good as it is. Honestly, I feel like the leaves would hide all the work you put into the branches. branches interesting. Very interesting. So Why, are no... you thinking of putting leaves on it? Well, originally, yes. Okay, how about yes. this? Yeah. It's winter at the moment, right? Yep. And I'm... So how about when it's spring, you go, you know, a bit of cherry leaves. Put then some pink leaves on leaves. it. And then... And then Summertime. Seasonal match it, yeah. Green leaves. Yeah. I like that idea. I think that's good. You don't do you need anything? I don't need anything, honestly. I just came to have a come to say hi. You just came to I'll say take one hi. of the permits. This diamond one. All the potions, never mind, you can keep it. <laughs> <laughs> you don't want that one, huh? <laughs> no, that seems like a lot of work. It's I'm sure you'll have fun with it, but it's a lot of work. <laughs> I, Joel, I got a feeling that permit, that might be that, the home for that permit forever. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> it's never going anywhere. <laughs> Can I go to your house and walk through your place? Sure, if you want to. I would really like to get like a, a Joel, a Joel walkthrough of your okay, place. Sure. Okay, sure. Let's go then. Don't look too closely around the base because there are some like, someone's been... <sighs> I don't know who did it, but someone's been putting horse heads around my base. Not sure who that was. Seriously? Yeah. That's crazy. Do you perhaps know? Because I've never, I've never done the science on this. Do you know how much leather a horse gives? Like with just, like if you, if they die. Is it one, or is it the same amount as a cow? Or I wouldn't know, Beatus, because I've never killed a horse. You wouldn't so you know. know no, yeah, see, that's the thing. But if I was to guess, mm -hmm. I'd probably say it's like somewhere around free leather, depending on if you're looting. But that's you sick guess. freak. <laughs> you're torturing my horse, by the way, holding that carrot. Oh, sorry, I forgot yeah. the carrot. Either feed it or, or get it out of your hot bar. What's in your hand? What is that? Sorry, no, sorry, I don't know where that came from. It was what here. What the heck? Just, it was there. I just helped pick it up because I didn't want to. Uh, it's okay, All right. It's okay. You know what? Accidents happen. I'll allow you yeah. one. Oh, look at this. Okay. Oh. Another accident happened. Another accident. Happy little accidents. Maybe we shouldn't have come in here. Oh, sad accident. You've hurt. You've hurt. <laughs> <laughs> it's the worst sound in the game. Okay. I love it. It's one of my favorite sounds. <laughs> that that would do. Yeah, it's great. It's really good. You like that? Yeah, it's really fun. <laughs> Yeah, it's just the two. There's, I'm sure there's no more around. No, no, no. You're lucky no, there's... They, it's so chaotic looking around here. Because, uh... I don't... Yo! <laughs> Unbelievable! This whole place is just a cover. It's like, um... What, what do they call those places? Uh, laundering money? You're laundering horse heads. Yeah, I don't know where... Unbelievable. No You're... more, though. No more. No more? Okay. No more, no. Okay. All right. Just hiding in plain sight sometimes is the best. Right here! <laughs> is this the one you had in your hand, or is this another one? <laughs> it's a different one. Unbelievable. Right. All right, Joel. Thank well, you for the tour. Fun. This is yours. Yeah, don't forget your shulker. Got it. Don't... Sorry about the horse heads. Uh... <laughs> Do, they were accidents, though, so you don't have happy to apologize for well, an not accident. Happy, maybe a bit Sad, yeah, sorry. miserable, depressing accidents. Yep. Well, that was fantastic. Love seeing Joel, even if he is um, killing horses. By accident, he promises. Oh, bamboo shop. Last episode we made... All these bamboo shops and I'm working today on getting the stock worked out. Hey! <laughs> oh! One stack of four of string for one diamond and we made a diamond! I can't believe it! 
I mean, this isn't even fully stocked yet. I'm just randomly, you know, just, just putting some here and there, randomly. This is how psychopaths stock their shop, I believe. We are currently in... Oh, 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 three stacks for a diamond. There we go. We are currently in the phase of uh, seeing how people buy. Has anybody bought any mosaic? Because I made a lot of mosaics. You filth. You filthy, filthy hermits. Mosaics are so hard to make. That's why I think they will sell. I might just have to push them. Certainly the crafted items. Nobody's buying crafted items, I'm sure. Yep. Nope, nothing, nothing sold here yet. We might never sell anything in here. It's possible that nothing sells from the crafted items and they will just buy. Aha, here we go. <laughs> three stack, one, one stack for three diamonds. Oh yes, we've sold. We made, we made sales. Oh, and three more. Oh, we made 20 diamonds so far. Are you kidding me? I have is this, I haven't even really started pumping and producing yet. Oh, that's amazing. Okay, that is kind of proof that people are just going to buy the. Oh, I think we're going to get a show here in a second. People are just going to buy the bamboo blocks. So that's going to kind of affect how we produce this stuff. This is fantastic. Ren has opened a beacon shop, which is amazing. Uh, I do want to see Corrales has opened a shop here as well, which is really cute. Lot, all the bee stuff, which is fantastic. And we got item frames, a new one. This is going to be very important. The ink sack shop that Joel has made. Which, look at it, it is so cool. I love it. And then copper. I really wish somebody would start making copper bulbs. Co copper bulbs would be fantastic to have, but in due time, in due time, we'll have that those. But uh, that's all that stuff that's in our shop, that's all the bamboo we have. So we have to, as I promised, work out how are we going to produce this stuff. And I've done a lot of testing, and I've come up with a bit of a system. Hello? Beat ups? Whoa! <laughs> you're in- you're inside? I, I was waiting for you, I decided to uh, just walk in, you know? That's so rude! You brought the horse in? <laughs> does- does he not belong in here? A horse has never been I in this house. I saw the hay bales in here, I thought it was like, uh... No, that's a carpet. <laughs> out, out, not out. horse food? No. Okay, no, okay. stop it, see? Look what happened. I know there's a lot of things you gotta yell at me about, okay? Number one. You're gonna, first of all, you're looking around, you're like, how does this guy get anything done? What, no beacons and clearing land? And, and what, how, what's this storage system? Uh, and I understand. I'll be honest, I've been that way with you my whole life, Peter. Okay. I honestly don't know what you do in this game. Dude, but come you here. somehow make, makes beautiful stuff happen. What's in this one without looking? In that one without looking is, that is like some plant stuff. Mm hmm. Um, just random, like, plant stuff and some Very animal impressive. stuff and drops and stuff. Yes. Yeah, yeah, mm -hmm. exactly. Mm-hmm. This is where you start uh, going into scar territory a little bit? A little bit, a little bit, except little I know where everything monster. is. Um, copper? Right here. <laughs> yep, yep, nailed it. <laughs> oh, snap. Yeah. I know the other thing. I know the other thing. We can talk <laughs> about there's, that. There's again. more, is there? <laughs> I know. I'm, I'm, uh, uh, mailbox. Location. Yes, we got to figure that is out. Is that what it is? Is that what you're here for? I actually came here to for a favor. I was I was going to compliment you actually, but oh uh, yeah, okay, okay, let's do that. <laughs> let's skip all the other bad stuff. Let's go to that. If you have five minutes, I don't want to interrupt you. I have five minutes. Time. Yeah, I got plenty of time. Okay, okay. Um, very impressed with your bamboo store. Thank you. You know what I love the most about it, B Dubs? The signs. That's not what I was going to say, but okay, okay, okay. <laughs> now I, I don't want to be rude. No, because obviously you, you very much like the signs. The signs I was very, very proud cool. of the signs. Yeah. But what do you cool. love most about it? I was going to say, I love how you added gimmick to your shops. Always like the oh. moss shop previously. And you have the, the scaffolding challenge. Yes. Um, I would like to demonstrate it though. If you're, if you got time to challenge me. Yes. In the we, scaffolding race. 
Yeah. Are you okay? I meant to ask you this. Um, mm -hmm. are you a scaffolder or a dirt person? So I'm usually dirt person or moss or something like that, right? Yeah. But I've been hearing a lot of pushback on it, and really, you know me, B Dubs. I'm not one that gets stuck in his ways. I'm always out to try new things. Right. Of course. So yes. if you can prove me wrong, I'm, I might give Scaffolding a try this season. I, I will prove you wrong. I will. And I actually, I got to grab some, um, believe it or not, I don't have any on me at the moment. Chest over books. Cleo, quiet. We're making a clip. <clears throat> We're very... Get in a group then. <laughs> Do you have a lead, Cleo? I need a lead. Just keep it down, Okay. I'm streaming. You we're, keep it down. We're very busy doing um, doing a famous uh, beat ups and Etho clip together. That's right. Okay. This is, is going to be legendary, good. obviously. Yes. Get in a group. Nah, we're good. I'll, I'll mute myself. No, 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 Cleo. I was just kidding. We love having your voice in the background. It's fantastic. <laughs> it's like uh, audience chatter. It's like audience chatter. Mm -hmm. Right. Mm -hmm. What are you two doing anyway? I am about to get destroyed in the scaffolding challenge, I think. Okay. Cleo, that do, sounds about right. Cleo, do you use scaffolding or dirt no. to go? Okay, come on. Come on. Etho, what? Cleo, both of you. Oh, no. He's yep. about to started. school us. Yep. Uh, here we go. You think you're so cool? <laughs> I thought I was. Can you stack up faster than a scaffolder? No. Oh. I'm going to try. <laughs> okay, you're going to try. I mean, we'll try, but no. <laughs> okay. All right. The The game goes like this. You pick your block of choice, okay, uh -huh. that you like to stack up with. You stack to the top, ring the bell, and then remove the pillar and ring the bottom bell. Once you ring the bottom bell, that's it. Okay. So no, no just jumping off. I got to remove my blocks. Well, Before you can just jump up. off, but the pillar must be gone. That's that's simulating ah, real I life. See, I yeah. See. Okay. 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 Three. Two. Wait, he's getting a head start. He's getting a head start. <laughs> okay. 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 I'll stand back, back, back here. I'll stand back here. On the rim, beat ups. On the rim. Okay. Get off the sand. What okay. Is this? Get, get on the rim, beat ups. Okay. On. on the rim. On the rim. Three, two, one, go. Oh, oh man, I missed it. <laughs> I'm up. I'm up. Oh. Somebody told me a way to do it. Wait, how close am I? Oh, I went way too high. I broke the uh -oh. bell. Uh, <laughs> and I win. <laughs> you didn't ring the top one. You didn't ring the bell, <laughs> <laughs> Some idiot. You know what? The amount of comments I got on my last episode where people were saying, oh, you should do this. Don't you know you can do that? And I just tried when one of the stupid commenters said, and it's worse. I <laughs> you added the trap door later, didn't you? No, no, they said go in it and start stacking up, but that doesn't work fast. That's slow. Okay, I'm not quite okay. sold on the scaffolding just yet, beat ups. Let's no. try one more time. I one think. more time, one more time, one more time. I'm gonna do it my way. Three, two, one, go. Stack it. Okay, he, he got those down pretty fast. And that should be enough. Wait, he's not climbing though yet. Oh, am yes. I not? Oh, I went way too high. How do you ring a bell? Got it. Got to ring it on the side. <laughs> Got him. What? <laughs> Got him. <laughs> it's a rock. Oh. Five. Okay, that was pretty fast. Six. Um, six seconds faster. Okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Do you want to know why I don't like scaffolding? Tell me. Because you can't crouch on the edge of it. Sure, but but that's easy. Then, then oh, watch, watch this. Okay. All right. Mm -hmm. I'm up here. I'm way up high. Oh, I'm yeah. crouching. Is that a problem? He mixes. Nope. He mixes. Wait, yeah. what? He mixes. Yep. Oh, he's not a purist. He's not pure scaffolding. Uh, oh, oh, okay. oh. Actually, what I actually do is this. I go off to the edge, shifting. See? So wait, if you shift on the, the floating one, you yep. don't fall through? You don't fall through, no. Oh, okay. That's not terrible. It's no, not... that's nice. It, it's not accurate, though, is, is the well, problem. Well, you just stack it one block higher than normal. You got to adjust, you know? I feel like okay. this is a high intelligence tool, and I'm just trying to elevate everyone. Yeah, but you're using it, B-dubs. Yes, exactly. Three, two, one, go. 
And here I go. Oh, oh, B-dubs has hey! the height. Hey, no cheating! <laughs> That's the way to do it. No! <laughs> <laughs> Got it. Oh no, it's a disaster. <laughs> said put that trap door there <laughs> it's gone again it's the worst okay i'm fixing the trap door man this is this is good this is bug testing man uh, well i was really impressed with the game beat ups now i'm, I'm having second thoughts on it actually. <laughs> i enjoyed it quite a lot Do you okay want to sell? we might have a couple of flaws two one go go you're not gonna sleep, beat ups. You're not gonna sleep. It's nighttime. It's you nighttime. wanna play? Let's play break. Let's play breaking blocks. Ouch! All right, here I go. Oh, there we go. Here we go. I'm here going go. for real. No! Who pushed me this way? Fine, cheat. Cleo's outfit on too. Watch. I still got the bell. Oh, I got the bell. I got the bell. Cleo, stop! Yeah. My whole business relies on this, you guys. <laughs> This is my primary sales tactic. I feel like the scaffolding is like open to trolling. Someone just comes <laughs> yeah. along and breaks it from underneath you all the time, right? Come in here close. Come in here close. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The the whole thing we can uh, the three of us we know about scaffolding is easy to prank. Okay, but let's just mm -hmm. keep that here between the three of us and not talk yes, to no anybody else. else. Knows that. We don't want that no word getting that. out. We don't want anybody knowing, oh, scaffolding, why would you buy it? Because you're going to get pranked, especially by with that's green right. on the server and stuff. So let's we, keep it we down. We get them to buy it and then we prank them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's good. That's good. Yeah, that's yeah. good. Okay. I will, I will, I will bankroll you a little bit. For real? A little bit. A little bit. Uh, I, I want your guys' opinion on this. 32 for three diamonds. So these are the tough to make ones. These right? are tough to make. Cleo, you need to change your skin to have like a bunch of diamond jewelries, like Bet Midler. Like I have like over a stack of diamond blocks right now. Unbelievable! <laughs> so give give Ethel some some money. I walked I by her the other day and she threw thirty two at my feet and was like, "There you go, you poor peasant." <laughs> Oh, nice. They were pity diamonds. Don't get they were pity diamonds, but I appreciated them very much. <laughs> okay, Etho, did you then want me to? You want me to make a, a game for your place? No, I, I have a game in mind. I just wanted to use yours as an example. You wanted to test way. it. I see. I see. I, I okay. wanted to demonstrate it as I was talking about it. <laughs> this is great. Let's show it. Like this is this a is, great thing. This is perfect. We had so much fun, right? I, I want that at my shop as well. We I, did. We did have a good time, and we now we have mm -hmm. a secret that we can all keep together out of it. All right. I know you never are supposed to go through your wife's purse, but I have to show you something amazing. Did she get a new phone? No, this is old. I've never seen this phone before. Now I see why they say don't go through it. You can never find anything. What is this? I'm starting to think there's another reason why they say don't go through your wife's purse. Aha, here it is. My wife is using a Ridge wallet. And why wouldn't she? It's amazing. Has the ability to hold up to 12 cards. Has room for cash. She's got cash in there. And Ridge is expanding their styles and colors to cater more to you ladies out there. There's over 30 plus different colors and styles. You can get like an AirTag attachment. If you lose your wallet, you never lose it then if you get that AirTag attachment. And the other thing I use is, do you hear anything? No, you don't because I use the key case. It can hold up to six keys and it keeps them nice and quiet. Ridge has a limited time offer for you right now. If you get a wallet and a key case, you can get 30% off. But if you're like uh, myself and my lovely wife and you want to check one of these out today, head to ridge.com slash bdubs to get 30% off through April, April 1st. <sighs> All right, so we got to do some sales. We got to do some, well, we did actually make some sales, which was fantastic. Uh, wasn't expecting that, but that's wonderful. Uh, also found some flaws in our business strategy. Um, but hey, uh, so far, I think business is good. We're getting the word out at least, which is very exciting. Okay. Now 
Have I just said it's been such a long day? We're gonna build the. Uh, it's happening. Now's the time. Come on, stop messing around, beat up. Now's. The, you know what? Uh, hey everybody, take a minute to see this segment that I had with Cub Fan. Okay, we had an amazing time, and Cub Fan made a wonderful thing for me. I actually have a a fireworks permit. It couldn't fireworks be more experiment. perfect. You're the perfect guy for that. It's been it's been wonderful. It's yes. been wonderful. I got a big factory and stuff that's being built. Yes. Uh, we're starting now to roll out explosive fireworks, and <laughs> okay. I need some way to promote this to hermits. And I uh -huh. thought you and this this area around here yes. might be the perfect spot to do that. You know, it's very isolated. So yes. You know, maybe not so many people will be here, but people come here specifically to see you yeah, all yeah. the time, right? That's people right. Stop yes. By. Yes. So, what if we put a couple, couple of these guys? You know. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh, look at that! Yeah. Okay. What if we, what if we put in like a little like demo, like a little exhibition in here? A fireworks, fireworks display. Yeah, that could go off at, at certain times. You know, that would be. Would that be something you'd be interested in? Get a free fireworks display out of it for you. I, I would be very interested in that. I, I've planned this to be potentially at night. I know I know you got a problem with this with the beds. Right? No. You got, you got... I'm turning a corner. I do have a bed problem. Oh. And it's okay. a, it's an addiction. But I do I'm turning a corner. I did witness my first sunrise uh during demise and it, it was kind of life-changing so i'm just dipping my toes in to the sun sunset and sunrise hours uh, this is perfect this is perfect then because okay b-dubs i'm gonna make it so that there's a firework display yes at night mm -hmm. but it only goes just barely into the night so you have oh, a reason to stay up oh stay up just a little bit just a little bit yeah yep. get yourself acclimated yep, that's perfect exactly. All right, so I'll, I'll get started on this. I'll let you know uh, when it's done, okay? Okay, okay, that sounds great. It should be popping any minute now. I think the light is supposed to be on. Oh, man. Is it backwards? Is it empty? Oh, boy. Okay, it's broken. It's broken. Oh, don't break nothing, beat up. Please don't break anything, okay? No, it's not broken. It's so full of stuff. Look at this thing he made. It's so cool. All the paper and everything. Oh, that's unbelievable. Okay, but I have it. Maybe it's turned off. I don't know. Oh, oh well. Okay, I gotta fix. I gotta fix it. We're gonna build now, okay? We're gonna we're gonna build now. And not by now, I mean we're going to the nether. Um, going to build, and I need to do a redstone project. Remember last episode when I did the uh, half-hearted uh, redstone with beat-up segment? That's correct. We're going to do a full-hearted one today. I've got redstone prowess to show you. I'm also going to put it, be putting my hat on now. And that smile, that's a fake smile. Uh, I am not happy about going to the nether, but we're going to do it because we need quartz and I need blaze rods and I know every... Okay, here, just here we go. Okay. All right. Oh, this is... This is perfect, actually. This is actually perfect and amazing. Oh. Oh, really? Okay. I... <laughs> I have wound up inside of somebody's uh, place in their... Uh, what are they looking for? Somebody digging for ancient debris. hey -ya. Does that block that? Block that more? Oh, boy. Okay, I want that quartz there. <laughs> okay, this is this is all I need. I mean, I need blaze for, you know, an inner chest, but that's not essential. Look at this hot tip. If you're scared that it's going to fall, watch. These look like they'll fall in there. I put two blockers. So if the item starts going that way, it'll come this way. And let's open up a nice... Oh, it's a big... Okay. And that went in me. Okay? And that went in me. And that stayed away from the lava because of my prowess. And we're out of here. Let's just take a quick peek this way. I, I know everybody's up on the nether roof. Uh, and that's where we'll connect up. Hey, I'm leaving. I'm leaving. I'm out. I'm out. Okay, home safe and sound. And I've got the things I need for my comparators. That's good. Here is where we're going to build. We're going to build right out back here. 
I feel like we made a nice canvas and I want to be very delicate. You know, when we stand back and look at our place, it looks really cool. And I want to be very delicate with the things that we add. And I think this will work out fantastically. It's back a little bit further, uh, which will be nice. And this was all, <laughs> I, I, I dug all this out. And this will all be worked on through, over time. But I think right here, we're going to build uh, a nice silo for all our bamboo stuff. Another stage in our bamboo empire complete. I like this building. It's a circle. Did you not notice? Did you notice? Circle shape. I think it looks really cool. Silos are usually thin and tall. And I want to treat this as like a bamboo silo and have it wide and short. I think it looks cool. It's just like a different take on a, on a silo. Ah, I think it's cool. And then, of course, there's some bamboo around. And then, you know, this, I imagine if I were to draw this as a cartoon, I would have, like, bamboo shoots and leaves coming out of the windows because it's just so packed full of bamboo growing in. But uh, now, is there anything interesting? Yeah, let me tell you about the outside first. So mainly bone blocks, but, of course, I'm mixing in some sand and some diorite and stuff and even the mushroom stems, which are so hard to get. We get some of that mixed in there. Just went with a regular deep slate roof. Um, so texture-wise, you know, it's kind of a standard palette we work with. This goes a little yellow, which is cool. And even a little bit of birch up there, just to add a little bit of difference and interest to the whole thing. But on the inside, nothing super special. Holy cow. Wait. What is happening? I built this whole thing. I promise I built this whole thing. What in the world? I could just... What? Whoa, whoa, wow. What? <laughs> yeah! What happened? Holy smokes! There's a candle flicker right there! What? Oh, shoot. I was wearing a helmet in my time lapse. I'm gonna look like an idiot. Okay. I'm a veteran. I can handle this. Any veteran knows when you have texture problems... You hit F3 and T. What happened? What did I do? Aha! I've brought it. I have returned it back. Yes. It's wonderful that the whole thing is back. Uh, there's nothing in here. There's nothing in here because it's everybody's favorite time of year. A full segment of Redstone with Beatles. What a lucky day. I have been researching the auto crafter and I'm going to show you there's blocks missing. Hello, there's blocks missing. Uh, maybe I never placed those. This is how the auto crafter works. We showed a little bit last time, but I'm going to show you a little bit more now today. Okay, this is how our whole bamboo crafting system is going to work. We're going to start from just bamboo. It's going to be just these bamboo shoots, just these, okay? We're going to start with that, and it'll craft all the way down. It'll craft the bamboo, the block of bamboo, and then the planks, and then the slabs, and then the mosaics. It'll also have the ability to make fences automatically on its own. It'll just auto-craft, which I think is cool, but... <laughs> yes, there's a but. A slight but. Um, because... Well, let's just talk about this first, okay? Let's just work about work this out. So, the way this works is you can close these things off. Now, we want to make blocks of bamboo here, right? We want to make blocks of bamboo. Uh, so, we're going to leave them all open. But every time an item goes in here and fills one of the slots, it creates a signal with a comparator. If you don't know, okay, this is for the basic people out there. A comparator tells you what, so, what sort of something is happening in here. So there's one bamboo in here, so it's giving a strength of one power out of there. If we put two, it's saying something else is happening and it's giving a power of two. If we fill it with all of them, like so, 
It'll give it a power of, I think, nine. Okay, it goes all the way up to nine. Now, no redstone signal being sent here. No, 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 nothing, right? It's not crafting on its own because you have to make a machine that says, oh, click. Once it hits nine strength, once it has all those things in there, we want to see a click happen. Okay, so we can use this other auto crafter. And once I click this, that's giving a signal of one. This is saying there's something in this slot. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and craft is what it would do if I set up this next thing that I'm going to set up. And this is simple, this is easy. I'm gonna use spruce planks because they're kind of hard to break if you have a pickaxe. And I'm gonna go like this. And actually, if you feed from the side, it's better. We can do this, we'll be doing this where we feed the hopper from the side, okay? And then the redstone will go here. So it'll say, oh, I've got a signal here. And it'll send it over to here and it'll craft. Okay, so let's let's do that again. Let's let's get a thing going. Let's put some bamboo. Once this hits nine, these will match. It'll say nine nine. It'll send a redstone signal through and it'll start making. Okay, so that's good. Uh, I've been studying Rayworks. Rayworks has a great just ex explanation of this. So Rayworks d d has some great stuff. I've learned from Suzuma that you can just go. You can dispense right into a chest, which is amazing. So this can just boop, shoot right into a chest. And then we come out of that chest into the next thing. So let's get confusing and let's get crazy. Okay. We want to just, now the next one, I think I will, uh-huh, it can do that. You can have this whole system once the, you fill all these and once the ninth spot is filled, it crafts the planks. Okay. But I think on the plank one, I'm just going to have a classic because I just want it firing all the time. Maybe, maybe I'll shut it off. But one of these two observers facing each other gives a tick, 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 tick. So it's simple. If I want to make slabs, then I have, you know, the planks go into here. It'll hit a signal of nine slots full. This says nine slots full and it'll fill it up now. This whole thing's gonna be controllable because I don't know what's gonna sell. There's no point in me setting this up to be automatic and craft everything. Craft the fences, craft the fence gates and stuff if I'm not selling that like crazy. So if we're making, you know, we don't need to make sticks all the time, but I'm gonna have a toggleable by hand, just by hand. I like doing stuff by hand. Check this out, okay? This is a hopper set up to where it goes here, it splits here and here. So I'm gonna put 28 in here. I should have 14 here, 14 here. And now I'll check, 14, 14, aha, okay. So it splits both ways. You can have it making um, sticks and the uh, other stuff. If I shut that off, now check this out. All 28 will go, it's gonna split, all 28 are gonna go over here. Okay, so I'm gonna have these little latches, this little divider set up. Oh, it's mine, I patented it and I invented it. And that's going to kind of control what's being made because we're gonna have just a couple of junctions in this whole thing. It's going to be uh, perfectly organized and perfectly optimized, but I'm going to build it now and I won't sweat. It's gonna be simple. I think I really understand it. Uh, for the most part. So, hey, let's let's let B-dubs do what he does best, shall we? I can't believe my greatness. Now, you know I invented uh, something called pretty stone. It means you do redstone, you make it look pretty. We're not there yet. We're not there yet because this is just the starter function, okay? Once I find out like, oh, need tons of bamboo logs, I'll make it all nice and pretty. But this baby works, this works. And just like my organization and my chest system, I know exactly what goes here. You know what goes here? Mosaics. Mosaics will go here, okay? Uh, if I flip this switch, it'll make planks and the planks will be here. If I flip this switch, it'll make bamboo uh, blocks and they'll go here. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know. And if I flip this switch, it won't make sticks. 
If I flip that switch, it will make sticks. That looks like that's on. I had these as redstone lamps uh, in my testing, but uh, don't have redstone lamps here yet. Now, this section here is a little different, and this is just straight from Rayworks. Just go watch Rayworks' video on this stuff. But and I, and I don't like doing stuff that I don't understand. I do understand this, but I never would have figured it out. Um, basically, it's not using the comparators at all. It's just saying, well, it's using comparators saying, is this full? Oh, goodness sakes. Okay, I made a mess. I made a mess. All right, let's carefully... We're going to put the crafting recipe for fences right here, okay? And it has to be stacks. This is an expensive initial setup. That's got to be full, and then this has to be full. And if this is full, and the one on the other side over here will be planks, if this is full as well, eventually we'll have them. But this needs to be full, and this needs to be full. Expensive initial setup, but then... This works to where it will craft the fences. Fences are kind of weird because they got different things in the recipe. Um, so that works out nice. Thank you, Rayworks, for making that. And the, the fences will come out here. Now, upstairs. Oh, boy. Let's make some noise, shall we? Let's turn the system on. That's my on switch. And you hear a bunch of clicking. You hear a bunch of clicking, and this is what I'm doing. This is how I'm doing the bamboo making. Let's just start with some bone meal over here and a little bone meal over here, okay? And I'm picking some of it up, but that's okay. This is just, I got bone meal for days. I got so much bone meal. And this just shoots the bamboo out like crazy. It's amazing, this is perfect. So, I'm gonna die, oh, whew. Don't look around too much, okay? I'm gonna keep my eyes down. There's st stuff around. Lots of building planning that's um, top secret. I'm gonna show you and prove to you why I did the system that I did for collecting the bamboo. Uh, these are like, this is like a common cell that you make where it's like, I think maybe 14 wide? And it t requires all these observers and all these pistons and it doesn't really make much. I have four of these. This is so much material. I have four of these, and it doesn't make hardly as much as just growing it. I just grew it here and chopped it at the exact same amount of time and compared it, and this was like 10 times more efficient. But as long as you have the bone meal, this thing, it just spits it out like mad. Now, this is beat up perfect redstone, okay? Some of you might think you see flaws in it, but it is perfect. All right, we got bone meal getting spammed on it on either side, and it just break. Once it sees, oh, you're too tall, I break you, okay? And there's a hopper minecart right here that's collecting the stuff right under it and then shooting it out here. I mean, that's not necessary uh, in what we did, but for the way I play, this is just better. This is better. For the stage I'm at in the game, with not having a lot of redstone stuff and having to go to the nether to get quartz, this is this is the best for me. It's just going to make tons of bone meal or tons of bamboo. Let's shut it off and let's only make blocks. Let's just do it. Turn it on. It's fairly quiet from down here, which is fantastic. But right now, it should be. <laughs> we should have already seen bamboo blocks in here. Aha! I found it! There was dirt- a dirt clog in the system. Okay, we're making bamboo blocks. Perfect. Just as I uh, presumed. There was a clog, as expected when you first make it. You expect to have a clog. Okay? So there we go. Already four bamboo blocks. These are- these are- these are tough to come by. And it's just crafting them like crazy. Now, let's release the valve. Let's start making planks, shall we? And sure enough, we'll see planks start coming in. Here they come. Like crazy. Oh, yes. All right, now, and, and normally I just have these off, right? Say I need a bunch of mosaics. All right, that's off. Here come, here come the mosaics. They're coming. They're making slabs right now, right here, right here. Should be making slabs right now. Oh, right, right, okay. This is why uh, I wanna label everything and why I promise I will label everything because this, if that switched, it pushed everything to the fences, okay? Did it? 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. It pushed everything to the fences. So now, ah, yes. As I promised. We're getting mosaics, which are hard hard to make. But uh, right now, I think for our purposes, we just want the bamboo blocks. Now this switch right here, this is the sticks. Okay, we aren't making any sticks right now. So this hopper is empty. Let's turn it on and we'll start crafting. Yeah, 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 baby. We're crafting sticks. Okay, we don't need any right now. We just want the bamboo blocks. But this is perfect. This is perfect because I don't know what people are going to buy. Right now, it seems like people buying the bamboo blocks like crazy. So I think that's the thing that I just need. I don't want to waste any of this going into making a bunch of other stuff if I'm not going to sell it. Now, you'll see this here. And this isn't supposed to happen. Why is all this bamboo fly out? Where did this come from? What is... Hey! Put the bamboo inside! What are you shooting out the side for, you stupid? Hey, okay. This is a simple fix. Sometimes you run into problems when you're doing redstone. It's a little chaotic up here, okay? Hey, stop it. Okay, and that's a problem solved. And here comes another problem solved right here. We're going to knock this out. And we're just going to put dirt right here. Solve that problem. Now, the leak is fixed. Did I mention it's pretty much clog proof, too? We got a slight clog here. But uh, every time one comes in, one goes out. It's a pretty, pretty great job by me. Am I right or am I right? It clogged. It, it's not clog proof. It's not clog proof. It clogged. Okay. All right. Perfect. All right. I, oh, goodness sakes. It was right at the end, too. Okay, it clogged. There was only, like, a stack there. And right at the end. Okay, perfect. Now, I want to see this thing unclog all the way. Okay, get all the bamboo out of there. And how much did we get? Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, zero. And that's the last of it. That's all of them. Okay, all right. In about, it was about 20 minutes that that was running. Okay. In 20 minutes, six stacks. That's, that's good. I think that's good. It's fast. All the other ones. And of course, I can kind of, um, I can combine it. I can have one that's running all the time that I'll, I'll, I'll pop it in here somewhere. That's, that's just persistently running. But I do need that system to where if I want a bunch... At some point, I got to just, you know, fill it with bone meal and boom, 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 boom. It goes. By the way, I'm trying a new technique. It's called uh, it's called button pressure plate stones on the ground. It's a new technique I'm trying out. And I, I think I like it, actually. I think it looks kind of cool. I really like this. <coughs> I really like this building. I think it looks beautiful. What a great, great thing to have in the back of our it's like a circle barn i love it it's so cool okay so we got bamboo going we're in good shape now we can move forward i think we got cyberpunk plans coming very very soon ladies and gentlemen thank you so much for watching i love you to death and we'll see you in the next episode that character from Titanic with the red hair? She pushed Leonardo into the water. Mm. Rose. Rose, there you yes. go. I don't, you just blew my mind. You I can't that? believe it. I can't <laughs> believe it.